So as you can see, I am actually nowhere near that windmill. I am however on top of a hill and my house is down there somewhere. So I'm generally having a walk, making the most of this beautiful weather, which we rarely get in England. So today I had a go at making my own homemade lava lamp thingy-majiggy. This is what happened. So I started off with the nearest jar of water and filled it up just under a quarter of the way up. You can use any kind of jar or glass. I then proceeded to fill up the rest of the glass with vegetable oil, trying not to spill any. Now because water's dense of an oil, you'll notice the oil just sits nicely on top of the water like so. Now let's see what happens when I add this food colouring. Notice how it doesn't disperse in the oil? Now watch as I throw in this fizzy vitamin C tablet. The water and the food colouring should mix together. As the tablet starts to react with the water, the fizz that's released begins to lift up the bubbles in the jar and then drops them again, creating this lava lamp effect. You can also use different coloured food colouring. Or you can stick a torch under it and make it like a real lava lamp. It's also completely reusable, so if you ever get bored, just put another tablet in and watch the bubbles flow. So I hope you enjoyed that demonstration. I am now going to head back down there somewhere. And at the same time, I'm going to try and not stand in any... Oh, sh There's a pony.